Welcome to Ignite Your It Factor Online. I cannot tell you how excited I am to have you with us. Over the next 10 modules, you're going to learn how to become the go-to expert in your field and how to use videos to instantly build your brand and income. I will be sharing with you all of my tips, secrets, and strategies for creating a high-profile brand that lets you have the freedom and income to do more of what you love with who you love. I will be answering your questions and will be here to support you every step of the way. Plus, you can receive constructive feedback on videos that you post to our private Facebook forum. It's like having your own director anytime you need it. I know that this is a big step for you. Embracing your genius and stepping into the spotlight isn't always easy. But like anything, the more you practice, the better you get. So just remember that you are not alone. So get started and let us know if you have any questions along the way. When treatment ended, and your medical team gathered around to celebrate, instead of feeling relief or excitement, did you find yourself feeling fearful, worried, and no idea how to step back into life again? If so, you're not alone. Many survivors have described this time where they feel like they should be celebrating, more like walking up to the edge of a cliff, being shown a beautiful horizon across the way that is their what's next after cancer, but with no bridge or support to get there. Instead, they look down and all they see is a thousand foot drop. My name is Tamber Lane and I'm a certified professional coach. And for three years, I was the caregiver to my late husband who was diagnosed with cancer when he was only 34 years old. I now coach cancer survivors on how to create a plan to navigate through the unknowns of survivorship and build that life where you feel like you're not just surviving your cancer, but where you're truly thriving. Did you know that experts in survivorship say that every survivor should be provided with a care plan when treatment ends? Most survivors don't. And for those who do have plans, those plans are only focusing on the medical aspect of survivorship and offer nothing to help you plan for the rest of your life. It's time for survivors to stand up and let the medical community know they want and deserve a comprehensive care plan for their whole life. But to be a strong self-advocate, you first need to get educated. And since I know survivorship can be overwhelming and stressful and exhausting, I've put together a couple of helpful tools. Just fill in your first name and email address below and I'll send you a free downloadable interview called Cancer Survivorship Care Plans, a blueprint for thriving and a short article with a list of resources so you can take the next step to take charge of your life after cancer. Once again, I'm Tamber Lane, and I wish you a life that is well beyond ordinary. As a driven and high achieving woman who loves what you do, do you find that you are successful as defined by your peers and colleagues, but you're not where you know you could and deserve to be? And that the path to success is leaving you with little to no time for yourself, and lately the reward for all your hard work is just more work and, quite frankly, extra weight? Are you tired of business and career coaches that just don't understand your desire to look as good as the results you deliver? And what about those fitness and wellness coaches who just don't get a day in your life? Wouldn't it be nice if you could find someone that understood both your financial goals and your desire to rock your little black dress? I'm Nafisa Shireen, and as someone who has walked a mile in your high heels, I can teach you how to prioritize yourself without feeling guilty and still create the amazing outcomes that get you noticed, catapult your success, and help you make a lot of money. In a few short weeks, I'm going to be revealing the secrets and principles that I use to take me from 50 pounds overweight and reasonably successful to being in the best shape of my life at 40, winning fitness competitions, and catapulting my net worth to over seven figures. If you are curious about how you can prioritize yourself to phenomenal success, submit your info below and we'll make sure that you're the first to get it. Do you want a fabulous home that you could entertain a few friends and family? Or how about giving a great dinner party? 
Would you like to experience the luxury of a five-star hotel all in your home? Or do you ever walk in your home and say, this just isn't right. It doesn't represent me. It doesn't represent the success and the extraordinary life that I have. Well, I can take out all that stress and uncertainty. I can create for you a beautiful space that is authentically you. I'm Cheryl McLean, and I'm the Principal Interior Designer at Decoria Interior Designs. And a while back, I got my master's in architecture. I thought I had it all together. But my passion, my passion was in interior design. I love to impact people's lives and have them walk into their space and say, this is home. I know that you're a busy person and I know that your time is precious to you and I respect that. And the feedback that my clients give me they say the partnership that we have, it actually saves them time. I also know that you're smart in the way that you choose to invest. And that's why I save you money by preventing you from making all those costly mistakes. So let's get moving on turning your dreams into a reality, making your home a beautiful home that you're proud to be in. Give me a call or drop me a line. You can find me at decoriadesigns.com or you can email me at info at decoriadesigns.com. I look forward to talking with you. You feel like you soak up the energy from other people? Ever start running that energy and feeling the emotions of others? You ever avoid places where there are too many people? You ever thought to yourself, wow, I had a really crappy day. But when you think about it, nothing bad happened to you, it just happened around you. You might be energetically sensitive. Hi, I'm Kelly Fisher, founder and CEO of Bright Energetics. I'm energetically sensitive too. It used to leave me feeling overwhelmed and exhausted. I would literally avoid malls from Thanksgiving until mid-January because of all that energy. And guess what? I was in the Navy at the time. Talk about high stress. I finally decided I had to get to the bottom of it. Our kids got a little older. They started wanting to go to the zoo, Disney, and the mall. It took me almost 10 years to figure out what was going on. Now it's estimated that 20% of the population is energetically sensitive. There's a lot of conventional wisdom out there that'll tell you that if you're sensitive to energy, that your life is gonna suck. You're gonna have to deal with it, and it's pretty much gonna make your life miserable. I'm here to tell you it doesn't have to be that way. Sensitivity is a tool, pure and simple. Learn my simple process to make it your gift, not your burden. Learn more. Put your name and email in that little box over there and get my energetic sensitivity assessment. Let's work together to turn your sensitivity into your superpower. Are you a mom who is doing everything that you know to keep your kids healthy, but they are still getting sick? Are you tired of chasing symptoms and feeling exhausted by trying to figure out what healthy means and how to get there? Perhaps you're not really sure. You even want to know what you need to do to achieve this vibrancy because it will be just one more battle to wage with your kids and you just don't have the energy to fight it. Well, if this sounds like you, then congratulations. You've found the right place, the community. I'm Dottie Hagmeyer, and as a nurse, I thought I was doing all the right things to keep my kids healthy. I mean, after all, that's my job. But despite all my best efforts, my kids continued to be sick, and I was sick too. I felt at the mercy of the next bug that was going around because I knew it meant that the sick cycle was just going to continue. 
I was so exhausted and overwhelmed and the thought of trying to figure out how to break out of the cycle and get my kids to transition seemed way more than I could deal with. And I felt so alone through this process. But the great news is I did find the answers and solutions that helped me regain my energy and confidence as a mom to lead my kids to greater health. I began Moms in Charge to provide this empowerment for moms in a like-minded community to guide them on their journey to not only get their kids healthy, but keep them healthy. I invite you to join this amazing community and become empowered to have the healthy, vibrant kids that you deserve. To so sign up, to start your journey, and I'll send you a free gift to help you with your first steps. So let's get started.